How did the idea for Women of Color Summit come about? Well, you know, back in 2017 and 18, um, I decided it was time. You know what? You have the experience, you have the qualifications, you have the connections, you have the education. It's, it's your time to pursue CEO and executive director roles. And I hired an executive coach. I got CEOs, male, female, uh, black and white, to mentor me. I convened high level mock interviews and I wanted to prepare. I just was not going to take this lightly. I knew it was that I had to prepare. And so as I started my journey to pursue CEO roles that I knew I was highly qualified for and had the background and experience to lead. And once I got that no, I realized that I wasn't alone, that there was truly still major barriers uh, systematic racism, uh, particularly as it relates to women of color in Black women. And so I wrote my story, and it was a story, it was my truth, it was my lived experience, uh, really trying to become a CEO in a community that I had served for many years, a community that I know um, and gotta know. So I told my story and many other women of color who have hit barriers and ceilings and women from all over the country, all over New York State contacted me and said, me too. It was Asian women. It was Latina women, other African-American women that said, me too. I am qualified. I have advanced degrees. I have master's doctorates. I know fundraising. I know cultivating relationships. And I got to know. So we came together over about nine months and planned an incredible summit in Niagara Falls, which over a hundred women from all different industries, corporate, nonprofit, academia, faith-based came together. And we had allies in the room. We had white women in the room that said, I get it. And that's one of the reasons I came to Heritage because we have an ally out there and our CEO, uh, Marisa Geithner, who said, I believe in you, Sarah. I believe in what you're doing. And we wanna bring this work under Heritage. We're doing this type of work at Heritage and we wanna bring you over and work with you as an ally to advance this issue, not just to talk about it, but to actually intentionally work to develop strategies to tear down those walls and barriers for women of color that just want an opportunity to lead in their communities.